Hi everyone, we're gonna talk a little bit about how to retrieve your Zoom recording link. First of all, go ahead and open Zoom. You're gonna to come to a home screen that looks like this. Uh, right here, you're gonna see two options, upcoming and recorded or something like that. It's gonna look a little different to you than it looks to me. Let me get rid of all this clutter on my screen. Um, you're gonna look for this recorded tab. So go ahead and click on that. And right here you'll see all the webinars or Zoom rooms that I recorded are gonna be listed right here. So here, as I highlighted, is your um, recording link URL. So with that, you can right click, click copy, and then you can take that URL and put it into an email, format it into a link in Google Sites, Google Classroom. Um, you can upload it into a document in Google Drive, or you can um, go to that link and download it, which I will show you now. So I've, I've copied this link. Now I'm gonna go to my web browser. I'm gonna right click and paste that link and click enter to visit that link. This is gonna show me my recording. As you can see here, this was the title of my Zoom room, Getting Started with Screencastify. Yours will, will reflect your title. And right here it says download three files. Now what that's gonna do is download a file with the chat, a file with the Q&A, and a file with the video. I'm gonna go ahead and click It'll ask me where I want to save. I'll just click my desktop for now. Click save. And this is going to ask you for the text file then. Just go ahead and click save. And then this is for the, I believe this is audio. Click save. So this will download all of those files. You only really need the first one, uh, this MP4 file. Because that is your video. Uh, like I said, the text is the chat, I believe, and then this M4A, that's just your audio. So really, like I say, you only need this MP4 file. But that's okay. Let them all download. Um, that's the only option you have, so that's all right. Then wherever you chose to save it, in my case, the desktop, that's where it's going to live. So then I'm going to find it. It's right here, how it comes up in your downloads. It's going to look a little different for you if you're on PC, but I just click on this arrow and click show in finder. But like I say, wherever you save that file, for instance, your desktop, that's where it will live. Like right here is mine. Let's double click. Here's my video. And that's the beginning of my Zoom room um, webinar. Okay, so now I have this file. Now what I can do is I can upload that to my Google Drive, for example, or to a YouTube page or what have you. So if we do navigate to Google Drive, what you'll want to do, go up here, click on your waffle, Google Drive. So this is your drive right here. And what you can do is simply drag and drop this in. and this video will upload for you. Whoops. If you do that, then that video will upload for you. There we go. Drop files instantly to upload them. I'm not gonna do that right now because I do have something else uploading in another tab, but that is as easy as it is. Then you can right click. Let me find another video example. I might not have one. So just like anything in Google Drive, you can right click, and get the shareable link. Right here's your shareable link. So then that links directly to the video also. Um, you could also just send out the, the Zoom link uh, from where we first accessed it, right here in the recorded tab. Uh, for some reason right now it's not coming up, but it is there usually. Right under your recorded tab, the link will be there. So those are just a few things you can do with your Zoom recording. Hope that helped a little bit. Thank you very much for watching. And feel free to shoot me some questions if, uh, if you need. GruberJ at CLIU.org. Thank you.